So tonight, Elvis fans filled a downtown venue for the start of Elvis Fest 2022. WTVA's Alyssa Martin was there for the kickoff event. She's joining us in the studio with all the excitement. Emily, a lot of excitement filled downtown Tupelo tonight. More than 300 people were at the Tupelo Cotton Mill. This was for the opening night, the Showcase Gala. It was a sold out ticketed event tonight. It was the opening night VIP party festival sponsors and several hundred Elvis fans were at that event. It was a sellout crowd. This kicked off four days of Elvis Fest in downtown Tupelo. Every year, the festival brings in thousands of people, both nationally and internationally, which means big business for the city. We have all of these people coming here. I think Tupelo presents itself very well. It's going to be a big plus for Tupelo because they are staying in town uh, and they're, they're visiting our hotels. They're eating at our eateries. And tonight's main event, everyone came out for this. It was a concert hosted by multiple Elvis tribute artists, many of whom have actually won the ultimate Elvis tribute artist competition in Tupelo in the past. It's just, it means more in Tupelo. I travel all over the world. I do a lot of festivals, a lot of shows, but when you come to Tupelo, it, I hate to say the cliche, it's like coming home. Tupelo is special to Elvis, it's special to us Elvis guys and the fans. Tonight, Tupelo Mayor Todd Jordan also presented a key to the city of Tupelo to the winner of last year's tribute artist contest, Alex Mitchell. Elvis Fest continues through Sunday. A lot of events happening. Make sure to stay tuned to WTVA for much more festival coverage.